Hi, this is Dr. O'Connor. Welcome to Pathways to Chemistry. Many of you know that archaeologists are able to determine the age of an old relic if it's made of bone or wood. And how they do that is they measure the amount of carbon-14, which is a radioactive isotope. By measuring the amount of carbon-14 that's in the object, then they're able to determine the age of a particular relic. So here we're told that radioactive decay is a first order process. And then we're asked if 16.5% of the original amount of carbon-14 is present in an old wooden bowl, how old is the wooden bowl? The half-life of carbon-14 is 5,730 years. So this method only works, right, for very old objects because here we have a half-life of 5,730 years. So we know that we have first order, so the first thing we need to do is determine our rate constant K. So for a first order process, the half-life is equal to the natural log of 2 divided by K. And we can go ahead then and solve for K here. So K is equal to the natural log of 2 over the half-life, and that's going to be natural log of 2 over 5,730 years. And that is going to give us 1.2096.8 times 10 to the negative 4, and then that's uh, per year. Okay, so we have this. We'll take care of significant figures in a minute. So now what we need to do is use the first order integrated rate law to determine the age of the wooden ball. So let's go ahead and set that up. So what we have is the natural log and we'll have the, um, here we'll put the carbon 14, okay, um, at some time t divided by the initial amount of carbon-14. And that would be equal to a negative k times t. Okay, so what we're going to have to do is solve this equation for t. So what we have is, after so many years, the amount of carbon-14 after so many years is 16.5%. And originally, there was 100%. So we can go ahead and fill this in. So here we have 16.5%. And the initial concentration was 100%. And that's equal to a negative K, 1.20968 times 10 to the negative 4 and then times t. So what we need to do here is solve the equation for t. They're asking us how old the wooden bowl is. So let's go ahead and solve this for t. So that's going to be, we have the 16.5% over the 100%, and that will be over 1.20968 times 10 to the negative 4 per year. And that will equal T. We'll go ahead and put this into the calculator. And I get 1.48 times 10 to the 4 years.